the nauseating dinner theater we've endured throughout the centuries, these performances are by far the worst. Aurora, my sister. Aurora is quite aware of our desire to see Rebecca home. I'm sure she'll do everything in her power to oblige. We're welcoming our enemies to the dinner table now. Convenient, given she's the one who has the answers I want. Oh, for heaven's sake. Now I have to deal with the long-lost sister. Nick, please spare me your family's rage and paranoia. It is exactly this kind of lunacy which led me to steal Rebecca in the first place. What did you do with her? Oh, I'm sorry, love. But this prophecy has you all acting as fools, and I've no intention of risking my life to foolishness. Now, I can't trust Rebecca with any of you. I certainly can't trust the silly deer to endure on her own, so I decided to put her someplace safe. Imagine a spot where no harm could come to her, where, in fact, no one could possibly even track her down. Yes, rest assured, Rebecca is perfectly fine. At the bottom of the ocean. You're bluffing. Tell me you're bluffing. Oh, you should all be thanking me. Rebecca's never been safer. She has plenty of company down there. There's all the little crabs and... Oh. Oh, my sister, and I'll be forced to return the favor. Well, this all escalated very quickly. Shut up, Lucian, or I'll tear your tongue from your head. Be careful with your threats, Nick. Anything should happen to me, I won't be able to protect your precious Cammy. Okay, that is the second time I've heard her name. Just who is this Cammy? You have bigger problems. <laughs> Freya! Niklas? Which of these two vulgar parasites would you first like to torture. Well, it's half a dozen of one and six of the other, isn't it? Why don't you take the stable boy? Tristan and I are long overdue a good catch-up. Oh, if anything happens to Camille... Oh, I'm quite certain Lucian's aware. Devastating error. 